Hello dear students. In this video we are going to talk about two different ways of classification of alcohols. Alcohols can be classified according to number of OH groups. The first group is called monohydric alcohols. Monohydric alcohols are the alcohols which contain only one OH group like CH3OH methanol. The second type of alcohols are called dihydric alcohols. These alcohols do contain two OH groups. This is a compound which is used in antifreeze. And the third group is called trihydric alcohols. These are the alcohols which contain three OH groups. This compound is called glycerin and it is widely used in cleaning materials and cosmetics. The second way of classification of alcohols is according to the carbon atom attached to the OH group. In this classification, alcohols are either primary or secondary or tertiary. Often primary alcohols are shown like this, secondary alcohols like this and tertiary alcohols like this. In the primary alcohols, carbon atom which is attached to the OH group is connected only to one radical. Other two connections are to hydrogen. However, on the secondary alcohols, carbon atom, which is attached to the OH group, is connected to two radicals. And the third connection is to a hydrogen atom. In the tertiary alcohols, carbon atom, which is attached to the OH group, is connected to one, two, three radicals. By the way, these radicals might be the same radicals, but they might be different ones as well. Let's give some simple examples for each. For example, ethanol is a primary alcohol because the carbon atom, which is attached to the OH group, is connected to only one radical. Let's give an example for secondary. We have three carbon atoms and my OH group is on the second carbon atom in here. This alcohol is a secondary alcohol because the carbon atom which is attached to the OH group is connected to two radicals. They are CH3 and CH3. The fourth connection of this carbon atom is with a hydrogen. Let's finally give an example for tertiary alcohols. In tertiary alcohols, carbon atom which is attached to the OH group is connected to one, two, three radicals. That's all for this video. Goodbye.